There's no doubt this monster helicopter can lift a single dollar bill, but the question is, how many can it lift? Welcome back to Engineered Best. Today's line is 35.1 single dollar bills, so I'm attaching 36, and it's your job to take the over if you think it can lift this, and the under if you think it can't. When I got this fresh stack of dollar bills from the bank, the teller probably thought I was in for a fun night. And boy were they right, because nothing beats comparing theory to reality, but in this short, I'll only have time to summarize the steps and show you the results. So if you want to see the full beauty of this calculation, check out the full video. Anyway, to summarize the measurements that were made, I first found the angular velocity of the blades by strapping the helicopter to some wood blocks, and then I also weighed it down with some bricks so it wouldn't move. I looked at the blades in slow motion to estimate how fast they're rotating, which was about 1800 RPM. I also estimated the cord length as a function of radius by looking at a top-down view of a spare blade. To actually estimate the total lift force of a single blade, I integrated the cross-sectional lift force with respect to the radius and found that a single blade should produce about 0.86 newtons of lift. Since there's four identical blades, I multiplied by four to get the total maximum lift of this helicopter. As long as this lift force is less than the total weight of the helicopter and the money, the helicopter should accelerate upwards. The helicopter string and paperclip were measured to have a mass of 317 grams, which leaves about 35.1 grams for the dollar bills. Each dollar bill weighs about 1 gram, so the helicopter should be able to lift 35.1 of them, and that's how the line was set. I'll be adding 36, and if it can lift this, the over will hit, and if it can't, then the under will hit. Pause now to predict in the comments how reality will vary from this model. And now it's time to see what actually happened. With 36 single dollar bills attached, the helicopter did lift off, although I released the power a bit early so it wasn't super decisive, meaning I'll redo it with four more dollars to make sure it's decisive. With 40 dollar bills, the helicopter still easily took off, meaning the over has smashed the line. Congrats to those who got it right, I did perform more trials to see the maximum it could lift, so skip to this timestamp in the full video to see those. 